Titans Texans on EA Sports as we get late in the season getting week 13 kicked off well we've got one team here in desperate need of a victory having lost three in a row you know what when you have a losing streak you go back to the fundamentals and what I mean by that don't try to trick the other team just go and let's, let's just be tough let's be physical and quarterbacks be very careful with the football because if you can stop some of those turnovers, of course, it just gives your team a better chance to win. First down here. offense they've shown this season they're not a team that's going to run the ball very much second down coming up mallet's gonna keep it has andre johnson and andre johnson is brought down Oh, there's nothing like a play-action pass. When the offensive linemen make it look like it's a run, the linebackers are all near the line of scrimmage and easy to throw it down the field for that completion. Offense lines up here. First down at the 39. Foster. And he is tackled at the 44. Here's how the Titans defense. Last week, this group came up with three forced turnovers. Second down coming up. Play clock's running down. They feed it to him one more time. And it's George Wilson with the tackle. That's a nice, powerful statement as they establish the run at the beginning of this game. Uh, Jim, I, you're, you're right. I'm going to give the offense a little credit here, but, you know, somewhere, I don't know, maybe the defense going to have to put some weights in their pockets. you got to hang in there and make the tackle. It's third down, and last week, this was a problematic situation for them. Get ready. Break the up. Takes it from the eye. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. Nothing fancy about that, but it's a good run. Gets a first down. Now the offense has three more chances. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Johnson's lined up in the slot. And the quarterback gives it to Arian Foster. Foster tackled down. Play number six coming up on this drive. Nickel formation for the defense here. The Texans have it at the 44. Has Andre Johnson. Johnson's met after a gain of three. The drag route is a huge part of every offense now in the NFL. It's where the receiver starts on one side of the football, goes across the field, looking for those spots where he can catch it. And the quarterback that time threw it at the right time, right on target. Good yardage, just short of the first down. It's third down coming up. Split backfield here. Let's go. Third and yet. Gets the handle here. That's a gain of seven. Well, everybody talks about the pass in the NFL. 
when it's third and short, you got to man up and be tough and strong. Nice job that time by the offensive line. They let the running back get in there and pick up the first down. First down here after the run. Johnson's a receiver in the slot. Mallet able to fake into the line and still has it. Has Andre Johnson. Well, you play this cover, cover four. In other words, you got four defenders playing deep, equally spread across the field. Well, who's going to cover the end cuts and underneath? Nobody. That's why the quarterback got an easy completion that time on the end run. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Let's go. Grab 38. Three. To the ground, taking it up the middle. Second down. Marching down the field and taking their time. The pass is incomplete. There was no one open. Well, the quarterback that time tried to squeeze it into tight coverage, but no can do. The coverage is too good, and the football falls incomplete. This is third down. This long drive continues. And the 40 nearly picks that pass off. Whoa, the quarterback took a big sigh of relief after that throw. That pass was close. It was nearly picked off. And sometimes you just got to gotta make a better decision at the quarterback position. No doubt about it. Put three on the board. There's nothing like being ahead in the football game, no matter how many points it is, because now you can manage it in a different way, even though it's early in this game, and you make the other team come after you. Across the 10, and that's about it. He's tackled at the 15-yard line. First down on the way. Mettenberger's got two tight ends on the field for this snap. Out of the eye, here's the handoff. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. When you're going against a really athletic defense, there's nothing like reverses and the counter run game because they see it, they go, and you counter it, and that's why it works to perfection. The Titans have to be hoping this doesn't turn out like last week's game. Tough luck losers a week ago and trailing in another tight one right now, Phil. We're going to find out if they learned anything from last week's tight loss. So, Jim, when you get in situations like this, it's about making that one play that gives your team a good chance to win. of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Offense lines up here. And the give to Sean Green. He's brought to a halt. Now, here's a look at the Titans offense. Hoping for a reversal of fortune as this offense has not kicked it in the gear all year long. One of the lowest scoring teams in the league. That's second down coming up. Back to the ground. Nothing there as this goes for a loss of two. The Texans line up on defense. 
they have been shredded this year by opposing quarterbacks who have found a way to beat up on this secondary. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. Mettenberger's got everybody split out wide. Out of the gun. One for the deep ball. Samuel almost had the interception. I know we've all heard this phrase before. That's why they're playing defense, because they can't catch. Hey, the coaches don't care about that. When you get an opportunity, they want you to make the catch. Martin's got a chance this time. He's brought down at the 25-yard line. Of course, Jim, you and I would have called a fair catch there because...